ah, this is stupid. This is ah, this stuff. I've already been Candy Floss. I've already been Candy Floss Viper, Flash Morgan Webster, Millie McKenzie, and Jack Stetsman. All at once on my own. This is stupid. Five of Riptide's best, four of the world's best, and Jack Stetsman. If I beat them on my own, this is ah, this is a waste of my time. So you've got Mambo preparing for me by taking on Haskins, or the inverse, you've got Mark Haskins preparing for me by taking on Chuck Mambo, that is great, a great tune-up match to face me for the both of them. And you've got me, the number one contender for the Brighton Championship, the number one prize in Riptide, you've got me preparing for the two of them with Candy Floss. Techers versus Power you've labelled it. And I get it, credit where credit is due, a great, a great technical wrestler, a great one-dimensional wrestler for a 19-year-old. But me, power, you pigeonhole me with power when I'm the most athletic, versatile athlete you've got in a riptide. And on February 15th, you don't have time. You don't have enough time to get good enough to beat me, Candy Floss. Stupid. People have been underestimating me. People like TK Cooper. They think I'm just pink hair, lollipops and cuteness. But this is who I am. And on February the 15th, TK Cooper, <laughs> you prick. I'm going to rip your arm apart, make you tap, so you'll never underestimate me again.
What is happening wrestling fans? I'm Chuck Mambo, gnarliest wrestler in the world, and more importantly, the only ever, first ever, undefeated Brighton champion. And the day I won this title, I had one goal, to make this belt mean as much to Britrest as Riptide means to me. Now what better way to do that than to defend it against one of the best wrestlers this country has ever produced. One of the best wrestlers at this point in the world. Mark Haskins. Mark, you've wrestled everywhere. You've wrestled everyone. You've beat everyone. You can wrestle every style. You can hit me so hard it hurts to breathe. You can twist me into knots. And I know, at Deep Six, you are going to take me to hell and back. But that is what I want. I don't want to just have great matches. I want to elevate myself. I want to elevate the title. I want to elevate this company. I have never left a match with you, even a locker room with you, without feeling like a better wrestler. February 15th, I'm going to leave the ring a better champion.